Dear all, welcome to this tutorial dedicated to RipX Deep Audio. The best tools you can use to manipulate and remix rendered samples and MIDI, developed by Hidden Mix for both Windows and Mac OS. RipX is an outstanding software for music producers, singers, remixers, DJs, and even beginners that do not have any audio knowledge thanks to a very simplified and intuitive workflow. It is available in two main versions. The basic one, called Deep Remix, with all the tools to mix audio, edit music, and separate stems, and the advanced bundle, called Deep Audio, the best to correct harmonics, frequencies, and pitch, but also to restore sound, remove noise, and get support on STARA and AAX VST3 plugins. Check our video description to catch the 5 day free trial and test Deep Remix and Deep Audio on your own. These RipX bundles can be used standalone or within any DAW like Pro Tools. You can import any song with File, Open, or simply dragging and dropping it on the workspace. A dialog box appears with several ripping options. Select the recording type such as a single instrument or a complete mix and the stems to extract from it, including vocal parts, bass, percussions, and other sounds. At the bottom, set the correct trade-off between speed and quality, although we suggest to always take the best one. Once you click on RIP, the AI algorithm decomposes your rendered track into all its instrumental and local stems chosen. This way you can edit these freely and independently with the maximum precision ever, despite you start from a rendered sample. For this reason, Deep Remix is the best tool to edit samples, mix it with other songs, and adjust these to get clean and outstanding sound for online streams, club sets, or karaoke backgrounds. You can import rendered MP3, WAV, FLAC files, and also MIDI compositions directly. You can also enable Save Stems Only to extract and save the stems in a folder. Very useful to move quickly to any DAW or DJ set without going through Deep Remix. All your imported samples appear on the right as folders or RIPs within the RIP list panel. You can hover over any to get information on tempo, in BPM, and duration in seconds. Click on any RIP to open it on the workspace. The algorithm generates several notes placed horizontally in time and vertically in pitch according to the piano roll on the left. At the bottom and on top, you get additional notes representing background, percussions, or noise. In the bottom left corner, go to Set Musical Scale and then to Detect to set the musical scale and key. Then use Auto Pitch to scale to align the notes to the correct scale without variations. Whereas to change the rip tempo, right click on the background and go to Change Tempo. Click on any note to listen to it solo, or click and drag over any region to playback it. Moreover, you can click and drag above the timeline to create a loop region in order to play back a selected region continuously, especially if you want to live check the result of your modifications. A rendered track is usually complex, but you can use the Layers panel on the right to manage all. This shows the main stems, or layers, extracted under several colors, corresponding to the ones you find on the workspace. You can also mute M and Solo S each layer with all its notes and listen to what you want at the moment. You can also adjust the volume level the stereo panning, and apply audio equalization with either a low pass, a mid pass, or a high pass filter. With deep audio, you can refine each piece of sound easily and professionally. You can click on any note to playback it and also select it to edit it with all the tools above within the Audio Shop soundbar. With the Move Resizing tool, you can click and drag any note to move it in time or change its semitones. 
The playback starts every time to help you hear the differences. You can click and drag the edges of any note to stretch and shorten it in time. Whereas use the backspace key to remove it definitely. You can also manage large sections by clicking and dragging any region to play back it and move it if you need. You can also select over any layer name to select it internally. Enable the Edit Unpitch tool to show all unpitched sounds over the track on a vertical frequency spectrum. Click and drag over any region to play back it and find cracks, vocal breathing, and any further noise. At this point, press the Backspace key to clear the selected region completely, or if you own the Deep Audio Bundle, you can run the Noise Removal script on top. This removes background and foreground noise that overcomes a defined threshold that you can auto-detect. Enable the Soundbar tool to drop notes in time and pitch, selecting the instrument to use in the top right corner. Whereas use the Split and Join tools to split any note or join two notes next to each other. With the Replace Sound tool, you can change the instrument of any note by clicking on it. Moreover, enable the Clone tool and hold down the Control or Command key over any part of the note to copy all its attributes selected on top. This way, when you click on any note, these properties are pasted. With the Pitch tool, you can refine the evolution of the pitch on each note very precisely by clicking and dragging over it. You can also use the Pattern tool to change the pitch by following the pattern chosen on top. Enable the Smooth Region tool to smooth the note properties during time by clicking and dragging over these. With RIPX, you can mix notes or entire regions or layers coming from different samples. If you select these and go to Edit Copy, you can paste these on another RIP by right-clicking and going to Paste or Paste and Fit Tempo to match the current sample tempo. RIPX Deep Audio includes the Advanced Harmonic Editor and Chord Creator. Select the note interested and open the harmonic editor to correct and shape it with an incredible precision over a frequency spectrum from bottom to top. Enable the tools on top to correct and refine sound as you need by enhancing frequencies, adjusting volume, reducing foreground sounds, and much more. On the other hand, the chord creator adds chords to melodies in no time. Select the note or any region. Detect the key and set its pitch position. Then click on the notes multiple times until you find the right chord. RIPX includes loads of adjustments and effects collected on top. Select any note or region and adjust volume level, panning, or apply low or high pass filters. You can also quantize or flatten the pitch level in time. Add vibrato or linear pitch ramps. With harmony, you add copies at multiple octaves, higher or lower in frequency, and apply reverb, delay, or reverse all. A special effect called randomize applies a random set of effects that changes every time you play back the selected region. In particular, if you loop playback it, RIPX saves the loop as a ripple that you can save by clicking on its check mark. This is very useful to pick the right randomized effect you were looking for. Select the right rip and go to File, Export. Select where to export and save and set the file format between a MIDI composition.mid or rendered sample.mp3.wave. At the bottom, set what to export, such as your entire RIP, any selected region, or the content within the current loop region. Under Files to Create, set whether to export a single file 
or multiple files, collecting all the stems or the layers present in a dedicated folder. The noise removal seen in this video is only one of the features made with the RIP scripts, such as advanced written scripts in Python 3 language, to get the best from your audio editing. You can check these by opening the RIP script editor on top. You can also make your own scripts with Create RIP Script, starting from any template, including Introduction to RIP Scripts. Very useful to understand this language and make your first custom tool on your own. The RIP script editor helps a lot showing functions, objects, and suggestions to achieve your goal. RIPX can also be used as a plugin within most leading DAWs, such as Pro Tools. You can move any sample to RIPX, edit it as you need, and come back to the DAW seamlessly. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Check our video description below to get a straightforward link to RIPX Deep Remix and Deep Audio. And do not forget to subscribe.